The Capital Classic Tournament does count if a team plays in the Open Division at the Cap Classic. So top teams in this region always participate in the Capital Classic located in D.C., even though it is not a qualifier and one other local open Cherva tournament. This way, they are always satisfying the requirements to be accepted into bid regional qualifying tournament. So in a sense, it's kind of like killing two birds with one stone. Teams get a Cherva region requirement covered and get some solid competition out of it as well. This was some great information for me because being new to this area, I was definitely one of the ones kind of scratching my head as to why the Capital Classic was not a qualifier. As big as it is, so darn popular as it is, and with the amount of teams it's pulling in from across the country and internationally. Win or lose in this regional bid tournament, it is a great way to prepare for what's to come, whether that be USAV or the AAU National Tournament.